Hey guys, Free Shocker I'm here. Welcome to another episode of Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. In the last episode, we took down gym leaders Roxanne and Brawly, and pretty much did a bunch of errands for a lot of different people. Um, which is the reason why we ended up here. Um, so in this episode, we're going to be continuing on to Slateport City and deliver these Divin goods to. I forgot what his name was. Uh, what was his name? Uh, there was a guy in Slayport where we're supposed to give um, the Devon goods to, but I just forgot what the name, what his name was. Um, I'm gonna say Mr. Briny, but no, that's um, somebody else. Uh. That's actually the guy who drove us by boat. Uh, God, he's, he's on the tip of my tongue. I just can't remember. Wow, I just can't remember at all. Oh, well. Um, anyway, let's just go to Slateboard then. Yep, okay. Captain Stern, that was his name. Captain Stern. I knew I knew his name was like a um I knew his name was sort of a um sort of uh ocean related. I just couldn't remember what it was. Hey Made to the Slateport City. A couple of wingles there too. Holy crap. Can we actually sneak up on him? Nope, he can't sneak up on him. Dang! I was hoping for it too. Is this guy a trainer? Oh, this guy's definitely a trainer. Huey, we forgot the Machoke. Well, from our past experiences with a fighting type Pokemon, we all know that uh, Zarkara can actually take them down pretty well. So he's got New Guard, okay. Don't know what No Guard does, but. Guess it does something. I mean, why would you have an, uh, why would you have a, uh, an ability for no reason? I mean, we just got slammed with a seismic toss, and that did some damage. Alright, confusion. Yep, my chop's gone. Oy, Jet Trash is a little 12, nice. And then from what I remember, I think Taylor evolves at level 30, give or take? I don't know. They're, gonna, they're building Sandcastle, okay. I know there's a couple of trainers out here. I know there's a guy with a... Yep, there he is. I was about to say, there's a guy with a zigzag goon somewhere around here, and we just found him. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> most of these most of these characters I remember so well. And they're, mo they're like characters that nobody even remembers that much. Like, they're not important at all. Oh, gosh. Alright, disarming voice. Is that water sport? Yeah, it was a water sport. <laughs> I was about to say, I, like, I thought, I read it as Splash, but like, Splash? That's Splash? There's no way that's Splash. And then, obviously it's not Splash. Oh, well, our attack is down, but we don't need that. Oh, that's some damage. But this is Zero's done anyway. <laughs> Alright, this is the last battle, and then I'm just going going to go find um, Captain Stern. If I remember correctly, he's in the shipyard? I think he's in the shipyard. I don't know. Uh, we'll just have to go and see. Wow, I just noticed um, our Pokemon are heavily damaged. 
Uh, okay, time to get the into the main city sleep ports. If there's there it is. So to say, there should be like a staircase somewhere into the city. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. I got the I have like the biggest smile. Ever. What the? F Why is there a team? What? Oh. That's a problem. There's like a long line of Team Aqua Grunts sitting out there. Stern Shipyard, okay. Alright, let's see. Captain Stern, are you in here? Is that him? It sounds like him. Oh, it, oh, it is Doc. Oh my gosh. Huh. Alright, Captain Stern's in the museum. Wait, we were just at the museum, what? Yeah, the long line of, um, Aqua Grunts. Oh, they're gone now, oh, okay. What's this lady gotta say? Okay, just nothing of importance. Fifty bu- oh my gosh, that's even cheaper than last time. That's even cheaper than the original. Is that an aqua grunt? This whole place is teeming with aqua grunts. What the heck? Anyway, we gotta go upstairs because I know Captain Stern's up here somewhere. Wait, where the heck? Where the heck is he? Oh, there he is. I was about to say, like, where the heck is freaking Captain Stern? Uh oh. Oh no. You guys again? God dang it. Oh, you win some, you lose some. Alright, Team Uncle Grown, what you got? Got a Carvana. I was, like, I was like expecting a Puccina from this guy, like seriously. I thought you. Oh. Yeah, they use Puccinas and Car. They use pretty much vicious Pokemon. <laughs> These Pokemon vicious enough to handle. Oh, God. oh my God! Oh my God! What? How did that even occur? How did that? What level is he? Oh my God! He's level 16. What? Okay, we're completely not ready for this. Oh, that rough skin's gonna take us, though. Oh, never mind. Jetress is gone. Ah. Oh. Son of a glitch. Alright, it's Splash Claw's turn. God dang, Splash Claw's huge. 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 Alright, much shot. There we go. Yeah, Beldum's gonna be a catching up real quick. Oh, that's a I just realized we don't have um repels at this point. Or not repels, revives. We don't have revive at this point we don't have revives. I think in the original games you don't get revives until like you get like the sixth gym badge, which is extremely late. It was a good thing that, like by um Gen 4 they changed it to like after like two gym badges you can get revives. What? I'm actually, I'm actually, honestly, I'm honestly confused on how that's super effective. I thought dark types didn't do much damage onto um, steel. Man, we're just fighting with just half our team up. It's mostly my fault. It's mostly my fault. I forgot to heal. Hey, at least this guy's level 14. At least he's not that bad. Oh, okay. Is in in, in the um, the Christmas special, which is the, the last episode. I was wondering what Mudshot lowers because I know Mudshot lowers like some sort of a t some sort of stat. I was like, 
I was like debating whether it lowers accuracy or not, but it apparently lowers speed. Which makes sense, because Munchak sometimes hits the feet and then just lowers your speed. Anyway. Oh boy. Oh my god! Is that Archie? That is Archie. Oh my gosh. Oh, how dare you call me a scamp. I can't just imagine him talking with a really rape voice, with a really disturbing rape voice. Man, I like these new soundtracks that they gave to, um, to the, um, Aqua, Aqua bosses. Okay, I think Archie has a um, pirate accent, sort of. I should have spoken a pirate accent, god dang it. Yay, we got the different goods to him. What kind of boat is this, though? The Royal Unova! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Wait, it's scheduled to be complete in blank years. What the heck? Numbers too faint to it. Wow. SSN! Oh my god, the SSN from Kanto! Oh my gosh! What is this? The Submersible Pod. From Pokemon Ranger, I think! I think that's from Pokemon Ranger, yeah? Prototype Submarine Explorer Zero. I don't know what that was. Very SS Title! SS Title. I've heard of the- I've heard of the name. I forgot what it was. I know I'm getting distracted and all, but it's just that I just saw the ship and I was like, do I know that ship from somewhere? So I started reading and it was like the Royal Universe. Oh my god, the Royal Universe! So I remember, I remember, um, riding the Royal Universe just because, um, there's a challenge, there's a Pokemon battle challenge there in that, um, you have a set number of people in a, in specific rooms where you can battle, and you're supposed to battle all the um, the trainers within a time limit. Yeah, and I think it's like a five minute time limit. Yeah, but there are some people in on the ship that just talks on and on and just wastes you a minute of the uh, of your challenge. So that's like very very detrimental. Um. I don't think you're supposed to do anything else here besides the name raiders' houses right there. Anyway, by the way, other than that, I don't think there's anything else that um, we're supposed to do here. I know there's a bunch of shops here. Oh wait, we can buy freaking um, what was it? We can buy freaking. We can buy freaking um, the the stat boost items because there's a um, there's a energy guru. There we go. Yeah, and I think on a Wednesday he goes on sale, which everything else is, everything is like half the price. It's a good deal. It's a good deal actually. Um, other than other than the shopping and the uh, the museum, there's nothing else to do here. Uh, so I guess we can not go forward. We gotta. We gotta buy some, uh, items. Let's see. Whoa, 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 whoa. We can get a hyper potion this early in the game? What? I don't remember that becoming a thing. Oh, snap. We can get revives, too. Holy crap. Uh, yeah, this is... Buy it with all our money. Oh, we can get super repels too. Holy crap. Oh, excuse me. I actually do need one super repel because, well, yeah. We only need one super repel. Alright, let's continue uh, out this way, I believe. The heck? Wait. Hmm. 
soon. Wait, we can't. We what? I'm just sitting here quietly, like, what the heck is going on right now? Yes, I'm actually, I am confused on what's going on right now. Several. <laughs> Quote unquote, several. I only have two. Um, thanks, but no thanks. Um, oh, is that we got a contest pass here? And a Poke Block Kid, what? Okay, this is completely different from what it originally was. I like how I'm just standing there, just smiling and just not giving a crap of what's going on. Oh wait, that guy in front of me is a pedophile. I think from what I remembered, you get the contest pass if you're if you get to um what town was it? Uh Fall Arbor Town. I think that's what it's called. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! The biking path! Oh my god, it looks more spectacular than ever. Oh my gosh. I won't lie, that is, that is just amazing. I literally, I'm literally speechless right now. What? Well, we just walked in on a couple of runs. Fantastic. Hey, listen to that music. What the heck? <laughs> what the heck? It sounds like it sounds more of a rival encounter theme than anything else. <laughs> Got a puzzle. Not bad. Uh, let's go with the confusion. Why not? Oh, discharge. Oh, that does some damage. We did not do much damage. Um, let's go with Splash Claw because I know he's a ground type, and you know ground types are really, really powerful. <laughs> Encore fail. <laughs> All right, mud shot. Let's get out of. What the fudge? Okay, I'm confused on what just happened. Um, I got a freeze frame now because I have no idea what, what the hell was that. He just gave me a friggin' Orenberry for no reason. God dang it, Splash Claw, stop growing! Bide. Oh, no, thank you. Yes, give him bide because I don't need bide. What? Zakar is level 15. Jet Chest level 13. Oh, wing attack. Fantastic. That's just what that's actually just what we not needed. Uh I just remembered that Watson, the uh Marvel City gym leader, is an electric type gym leader. So yeah. Um Looks like it's gonna be Splash Claw's turn to Looks like it's gonna be Splash Claw's turn to do gym battles. If that makes any sense. Um, maybe it's that car. Maybe. I don't know. Let's see, you've got yourself an orange battery. Yeah, at this point in the game, the orange berries are useless.
Wow, Splash Girl is getting a ton of XP, I swear. Training training in this game is so much easier. Um, I know this is Route 103. Actually, at this point in the game, at this point in the game, I don't think any extra training is uh, necessary. Not from what I feel. Oh my God, that is that is epic. Dude, I'm just speechless on what they did to this route. It's just, oh my God, that's a Voltorb. Just gonna go this way then. Dire hit that increases special attack, I believe. I don't think we need that. Oh no, here comes the toughest part of the game. Well, for me that is. Hey Brandon. In the original games, which is to say Sapphire, this was the hardest battle of my, of the entire game because his freaking starter was always the culprit on my defeats. Like I would, it's it's you would understand if I if I was playing the original game. Oi, Slugma be really really powerful. Can I double team this? Can I double team and hope that I avoid the avoid another rock? Yes, I dodged it. Okay. Disarming voice to see how much damage that does. Duh! Fairy types have no effect against fire! Ah oh, man! How can I forget that? Like honestly. Alright, it's centering missed again. I think it's it's come to my attention that it incinerates that one move that burns your Oh god. Oh god. Alright, Jet has his turn. Uh wing attack. Wait, we have a Taylor! I shouldn't be worry I shouldn't be worrying about Brendan's uh freaking um Grove Isle. Yeah, because I got a Taylor. It's a flying type Pokemon, and well, obviously Grass type don't ha doesn't have any good of that English. Um, it doesn't have any uh, doesn't have much effect on. Them. Yeah. Anyway. Um. All right, spell them. Oh my God. All right, Zen Headbutt. Uh oh. Oh wait, I shouldn't be worrying. I'm a steel type. That will raw to rock type of type. Oh. oh god, that doesn't do much. Oh boy, I'm stuck using Zen Headbutt too. God dang it. Cause I know steel doesn't do much to water, and it's basically just slapping water. Because physics. <laughs> that rollout's getting stronger, I know, but. We this Beldum is a steel type. I mean, I think I could survive one more rollout if need be. Yes? No? Nope. Nope. I spoke too soon. Uh, you can probably see why this is the toughest battle I've ever faced. Uh. All right, much shot. Finish it. Oh no! Nope. More rollouts gonna be a one shotty. Almost a one shotty. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Alright, mud shot again. Oh, thank god I'm faster. Thank god I went for that mud shot. Oh. Oh, that's a lot of juicy XP for me. Alright, throw vile. Alright, here we come. Here comes the moment of truth. The future of this Let's Play comes down to this. 
The problem is, I'm much lower in, in terms of levels. Fury Cutter doesn't do much, because I'm... Oh my god, Gorovile is taking some heavy damage. Oh, Taylor might win this. Whoa, critical hit! What the heck? Oh, no, it's not a critical hit. Dude, that actually did some damage, though. Oh, god dang it! Ah! Oh. No, we completely lost this. Oh, no, we... Oh, no, we didn't. Uh... No, we did not. Yeah, just remember we had revives. Duh. Yeah, there goes. Oh, god dang it. I forgot he has Mega Drain, too. God dang it. Well, it didn't heal much. Uh, I'm not sure what. I'm not sure if I should play it safe. Yeah, I'm gonna play it safe. I'm gonna play it safe and revive. And I'm gonna revive Beldum. Yep, it was a good thing I played it safe. Uh, maybe maybe I should have done some extra training. God dang it. Uh, uh, we're just burning through our revives like like it's nothing. I hope Beldum. Uh, Fury Cutter. Oh, fantastic. Okay, okay, we can uh, we can do a little potion healing as well. Like Dredges. Yes. Alright, Fury Cutter, take it out. Take Beldum out, I don't care. Uh Alright, Judge has his turn. And gotta pray. I gotta pray. Gotta pray Groval doesn't use Pursuit on right away. Oh, good. He uses Fury Cutter. That does some damage! What the heck? Oh, no, no. Did we just lose? No, no, we did not. No, we did not. We got quick attack. Yes! Woo! Oh, that quick attack. Save. Oh, all that XP for Jetras. Oh my gosh. Woo! Oh man. Oh yeah. Oh, it feels so good. Oh, those revives. Those revives are the MVP items. Or I should say MVI. Most valuable items. Yes, thank you for the heal too. And we get the dowsing machine, nice. Oh, what? He's got a bike? You son of a gun. You son of a gun. Oh. Oh, you son of a gun. Oh, any before anything bad happens, I'm gonna... Yeah, before anything bad happens, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to end off the episode here. Even though I'm not, I'm really close to Marvel City, but we'll get there in the next episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, please slap that like button and subscribe for more videos. I'll be sure to push out more videos each week, and um, yeah. Anyway, um, I don't think there's gonna be any um, videos up tomorrow since it's Christmas. I'm gonna be at a party tomorrow, so. There, there's a heads up for that. Um, I'll get back to recording on Thursday, maybe, if my parents aren't home. Um, if not Thursday, then maybe Friday. Maybe Friday. Actually, no, I gotta do some off-screen training for Sapphire, because Sapphire has different um, EXP mechanics. I don't know, we'll see. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed, and have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Christmas is tomorrow. And I hope you guys get some awesome presents, because it's Christmas. Thank you, gotta thank Santa. Thanks, Santa, for all the good presents to the good boys and girls, and for those on the naughty list, you better be thankful, too, because cold gives you warmth. Because economy, I think. <laughs> anyway, I hope, uh, anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode.